everybody. I'm back today with a video on some Maybelline Color Show polishes. Um, I've picked these up in various different places from um, Job Lot to build, um, Big Lots. Um, whenever I happen to see them. And I never really paid more than a dollar, I think, for each of them. So I'll show you the ones I have and some color swatches of them. Um, my opinion on these polishes are all over the place because some of them are good and some of them are not so good. So I'll let you know as I um, show you the polish colors and the, um, the swatches, which, you know, which ones I thought were great and which ones not so much. So the first one I have is um, uh, Auburn Ablaze. This is a pretty color. Um, it's a, a burgundy with like a, a, goldish, a goldish shimmer, I think. Um, I like this, but it's a thin uh, formula. And it's most of these, I guess, were three coats. So this is Auburn Ablaze right here. And that was three coats. And it's a pretty polish. Um, not too bad. I liked it. Um, like I said, the, the formula is not great, but for a buck, what do you want? You know, I'm glad I didn't pay full price for any of these. The second one is Boho Gold. Boho Gold. And this is it in the bottle. It's, um, it's a bronzy gold. It's got a, a little green shimmer to it. It's kind of got a lot of different colors in there. And here it is on the nail. Another, like I said, three-coater to get it opaque. They're a little sheer and a little thin on the uh, on the formula, but it's a little different. Someone said it was a good stamping polish. I don't find that it works very well. So that's just my opinion. The next one I have here is um, Sapphire Siren. This is a really nice blue. This, this um, formula wasn't too bad, and I'm not sure if it stains or not because I didn't use it on my nails, but on the um, fake nail, it looks really good. I'm thinking it may not, um, it may not stain. So that's it, Sapphire Siren. Um, that was a two-coater for a change, and it was a little better quality than some of the others of the formula. And then I have another blue. And this one is called Blast Off Blue. Blast of Blue. This is a, a really shimmery, shiny blue. Very um, pretty. It's a, a little brighter. And here it is on the nail here. That's Blast of Blue. Two coats. Nice. That wasn't our bad formula either. And I have one more blue here for you. This is Frozen Over. Another pretty color. It's a pale blue. It, it reminds me a little bit of Cinderella by Sinful Colors. This is a three-coater. Another thin, thin formula, thin polish. Watery. But makes a pretty color if you do the three coats. Now I have a pink here. This is Chiffon Chic. Oh, excuse me, I have to see. Oh, it went away. Oh, I hate when that happens. I'm sorry. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Chiffon Chic. This is a pretty pink. I like this pink a lot. And this was a two-coater, surprisingly, and um, a better quality than the rest. It's a nice baby pink. Medium pink, I guess. That's pretty for summer. Um, and then I have, this one is, uh, must be, this says Vintage Leather on the front of it limited edition. This color is Red Relic and this is uh, semi-matte and I guess you could top coat it. It's definitely a matte but it's it's a pretty color. It's an orangey red and here it is on the nail. That was another three coats to be opaque. This one right here. That's um, Relic Red from the leather collection. And this one is Go Go Green. I like this. This was another two-coater. Not a bad formula at all. There it is. It's an interesting green. I like it. Very nice. And then the last one I have is um, Sweet Clementine. This is an orange, but 
again uh, three coats to be okay and it's um, a glossy finish this orange it's pretty summer color all in all these are nice shades I like most of the colors are good um, but the quality like I said of the the formula not so, not so beautiful I wasn't too impressed with it um, so there you have it that's some of the color shows that I have um, there seem to be an enormous uh, amount of these out and um, there's different collections and there's different colors everywhere but because I picked these up on sale in different places I don't have actually any collection so they're just all odd like um, you know, you can find them even on eBay and, and you can get like four or five of them for a, a, a reasonable amount of money. Um, just know that whatever you pick, you, you, you don't know what quality of uh, the formula will be because uh, it's very on and off. So that's it for this um, swatch video. Um, if you like my videos, please thumbs up and subscribe. Um, I appreciate you. And thanks again. Have a great day. Bye-bye.